Uh, hello viewers, uh, welcome to my channel and uh, today's topic is uh, intro abdominal hematoma uh, but before that uh, we know, to know what is hematoma now a hematoma is a collection of uh, blood outside of the blood vessels and there are several types of hematomas and they are often described based on their location you know and the examples of the hematomas include like uh, subdural, spinal, under the finger and toenail bed sub, which is known as uh, uh, subingual ear, liver, and uh, intestinal or uh, abdominal hematomas, you know. Now, abdominal hematomas, intra-abdominal hematomas, uh, uh, and the hemorrhage may be due to a variety of injuries or illnesses, you know. And uh, regardless of how the blood gets into the abdomen, the clinical finding is uh, uh, peritonitis. So peritonitis means the irritation of the lining of the abdomen, you know. And the hematomas may occur in uh, solid organs such as uh, uh, liver or spleen or kidney, you know. And uh, they may be, uh, they may occur within the walls of the bowel, including like uh, small intestine uh, or the large intestine, you know. And uh, hematomas may also form uh, within the lining of the abdomen. Uh, called the peritoneum or behind the peritoneum in the uh, retro peritoneal space you know so the symptoms uh, of the hematomas uh, depend on their location and whether adjacent structures are affected by the inflammation and the swelling associated with the bleeding and uh, the symptoms may include like headache confusion seizures or uh, subdural hem uh, hematoma you know uh, back pain and loss of bladder or the bowel control like uh, epidural hematomas you know uh, it's a symptom of epidural hematoma and uh, discoloration and uh, nail loss in case of the uh, uh, hematoma under the nail you know and pain in the nail bed now the abdominal or the flank pain in case of uh, spleen, liver, or peritoneal hematomas, you know. Now, the treatment of the hematoma depends upon uh, which organ or the body tissue is affected, and uh, then treatment is uh, uh, provided accordingly, you know. Now, the superficial hematoma of the skin and the soft tissue, such as uh, muscle, may be treated with rest, ice, compression, and elevation, which is known as rice treatment, you know. And uh, heat may also be considered sometimes, you know. Uh, thank you very much for watching this video. If you need more information about hematomas or any other medical condition, you can visit our website www.diseasesandtreatment.com. And please do not forget to subscribe to this channel for more informative videos every day. Keep watching. Thank you and goodbye.